you know, the key for virtual worlds is you find a product or a community that people find important to them. It could be moms who uh, hang out together and discuss better ways to raise children. It could be teenagers looking to meet new friends. Once you have that level of engagement, and it can come in a wide variety of areas, then it's really about how do you monetize it, especially in today's environment. So that's where you start to look at what are the types of issues or items that allow people to differentiate themselves, to impress their friends, flirt with friends, uh, make themselves noticed, and then how do you track that and how do you build a business over time. So engagement's really up to the site to come up with a community that's really compelled to come back a lot, talk to each other, hang out, and make it a regular part of their lives. And then it's up to folks like Two Fish to figure out how to monetize it. So the most important metrics in the economy are not just how many users you have. In fact, that's actually not that important. What's really important in an economy, which is how many users do you have that repeat each month? So how important is your site to them? They come back daily, weekly, monthly, and how often are they there? How long are they there? And then most importantly, as you start to track it as a business as opposed to a hobby, is starting to nail down which users are the ones who are going to pay for items. And so the question really comes down to is how long are they on the site? Uh, have they registered? Have they put down a credit card or some sort of payment instrument? And then have they started to gift or interact with other folks on the site in a way that you can see monetization occurring? At the end of the day, we all have to build a business here. The engagement is the important, the important beginning step, but then it's running it as a business where you're tracking, just like McDonald's does, which every month in the hot, toughest economy in the world puts up numbers that were bigger than the month before because they know how to sell more Big Macs and more Diet Cokes to their group of users than any other restaurant chain in the world. That's what virtual item and virtual worlds need to do. And that's where a company like Two Fish starts to give the metrics, the analytics that allow you to analyze the business so that you can start to look backwards and say, what, what were my most important users? It turns out, for example, that all my users who like anime buy things. So maybe then we should focus on how to expand the anime side of the business. I can only do that if I've got reporting or analytics to start to give me that data so that I can test to see uh, if I try different pricing, does it get better? If I try different items, does it get better? And continuing to tweak the business, no different than McDonald's tweaks its business every month.